Hi, I'm Tom and in this video I will show you why sometimes when you are using the default dimensions, the drive dimensions, they are measured in millimeters and sometimes in meters even though they are the same dimensioning style. You can see that if I create a new dimension up here, it's measuring in millimeters, which I want, but if I create this dimension, it's measuring in meters. And it's when it goes over 10 meters, it measures in meters, below 10 meters, it measures in millimeters. But of course, I want my dimensions to be all in millimeters. How do I change that? I go on the draft tray, I go to this change default style for objects button, and I click it, and here in the combo view, I've got my style settings. I will go down to the dimension settings, and here at the bottom on the unit override, I will write my desired unit. So I will write millimeters. I'll hit OK. And now I will delete this uh, dimension. And if I create a new one, even if it's the larger one, it uh, dimensions it in millimeters. You might wonder why uh, why the dimensions are behaving this way. They are taking the default uh, uh, FreeCAD measurements. So you can see if I start to draw a rectangle here uh, in the combo view, uh, I've got millimeters, but if I go over some distance, it switches to meters. And the dimensions are taking these uh, these units by default. So this is the default uh, FreeCAD dimensions behavior. It also depends on the units that they are using. So if I'm using the standard or meters, kilograms, seconds, it behaves this way. But if I set building euro, the centimeters uh, up here, it's always sticking to centimeters, as you can see, as you can see here, if I, even if I go to a large, uh, large size, it's sticking to centimeters. You can see it here, it's still having centimeters on. So, but I usually use the standard, uh, standard units and dimension in millimeters. Okay, I hope this was helpful and I will see you in the next one.